Hello my friends, welcome back to my channel, bonjour, mbote, it's the same jumbo, hola, hello to all my friends around the world, welcome to my channel, my name is Louise, aka Auntie Lou, today friends, we are tackling one of my goals to do this year which is we are getting organized we're getting organized friends and today we are recycling some of our beloved items so for today's video i actually have asked my friends my neighbors to donate to look at their closet to look at things that they no longer use which they have already used and have enjoyed and are ready to pass on to somebody who will also love and appreciate the clothing or shoes so today friends i'm just going to show you that by me doing this it's not just my house that is getting recycled it's not just my house that is getting um, um, who are giving away um, things so some of my friends like I said also donated and I have so much clothes right now on the floor which I'm gonna show you in a minute and I just can't believe it this came from four families we got four families who have donated these clothes and shoes and anything else that we're going to discover together because some of them are still in bags and some have taken them out of, out of the bag so yeah I just feel like after traveling and going to Africa where you know there's so much poverty as much as there's a lot of beauty there's also a lot of poverty and before then I used to every year recycle my clothes the children toys and boots and I used to just go give it to the charity down the road but lately in for the past few years now I've been doing this every year where I recycle my children's clothes and my clothes shoes because as you know children they outgrow their clothes and shoes very 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 easily so you, you just have to there's no point there's no point holding on to it you might as well pass it on to somebody who will also love it and will also use it and they probably will pass it on to somebody else so that way we keep it moving we keep it moving we keep it moving we keep, we, we keep it moving and yeah this is the way we are going forward this year again so it just so it happened that this year I'm just going to show you the process what I'm going to show you the process that I usually that have been doing in the past few years but without the camera obviously but this year we got a camera so we're going to show you how we separate them pack them and I probably won't show how I'm going to shape it over because um, that process is just a bit it's a bit messy and probably won't have the time because usually I just call um, the people who are sending things back home to come and collect it and I pay and we send it to people back home in Congo all right friends so stay tuned and let's start our process of packing our clothes and toys and shoes okay friends so now you can see that we have two bags uh, one suitcase and one one of those bags that I think they call it Ghana Moscow I don't know why they call these bags that name but that's what I heard they call them <laughs> so this is what we're using to start off with because we have a lot of clothes and I feel like this bag is definitely bigger than the the suitcase so we're starting with the bag first
Oh my goodness, friends. Look what I found. There's about seven tie here that somebody could use to go to church, go to work, take it to office or an evening party. It was just amazing. What a discovery. Look at this treasure. Look how many shirts I just got. There's honestly, there's about 20 right now from that, ba that bag and more tie. I just, my goodness, like so, so happy, super proud. I can't believe it. I'm just so, see, more shirts. So, so, so thankful. Look at this friends, a brand new pair of trainers is going to definitely give somebody a big smile. Here come the clothes with the tags. I just couldn't believe my luck today. To be honest, my friends are just the best. Look how much clothes that we have and they are so cute. Look at that brand new dress and there's more to come there with tags on. They were just too cute. It just makes you a bit like, you just wish your baby was a tiny 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 little baby again for you to dress them up again but no it's going to a nice home and we are happy to give it away but it was just so cute packing these clothes
more brand new clothes my goodness I just have such a big smile right now I'm just a little bit speechless I'm just so so pleased I'm so thankful to everyone who donated for this good cause Wow, we got toothpaste, we got toothbrushes, we also have some shower gel, some creams. Ah, oh, what a treasure! All these bags they contain so many lovely things in there. And now we have teddy bears, toys going in. So lucky somebody's gonna be having a big, big smile on their face. Here come the shoes, friends. These children's shoes. There's some high heels for the ladies. There's some trainers there's some sandals and this is done with the aim to give somebody a smile or at least to improve even a small bit of their condition in any way or in any shape so I, I hope that when they um, receive this they will also receive it with love as we are giving it away with love I am done. I'm actually sweating from all that packing. I've done like, I've been packing for about one hour, but obviously I had to fast forward the video because otherwise it would be a bit boring. But as you saw, some of the clothes actually had tags on them. And there's like brand clothes in there, shoes, I don't want to even name them, you know, but guys, it's going to make somebody so happy. And like I said before, this is coming from four different families, but it's going to help more than four different families. So I hope they will enjoy it. And I hope you guys have learned something that you could also do with your friends and family, you know, having hands down or even if not for you to send home or to send anywhere but it's okay to accept you know somebody else's clothes they've worn it already but like like i said look i as you've seen there were so many clothes in there like shirts i got actually one family 
the mum, my friend's um, mum, actually gave me £40 to contribute towards sending the, the, the clothes. And one point I was counting the shirts. There was about 24 shirts that I've just recovered from these bags. And I'm just so happy, super, super happy, really pleased. And um, I know for sure it's going to help so many families out there there was even these little these little angels you know like these little angel wings oh so cute for costume somebody could wear these for a performance somewhere it's just so so cute it's gonna go to a good home it came from a good home and this guy go to a good home and i'm just super 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 happy you know that um that is happening and i'm really really pleased so yes friends i hope you have enjoyed this video and i hope you'll be doing the same or you know are you like me do you also accept clothes from other people and do you also do this kind of stuff let me know in the comment section if you also accept clothes or if you also do any kind of donation or sending or charity it makes you feel really happy it adds something to your spirit knowing that you're not just throwing away things that you know it could help somebody and there was even some um, kitchen items but yeah I need to look for a another video to do for that because for today I think the video would be really really long if I have to show everything that was donated to me so all right friends <laughs> I need a break I need a drink so until next time obviously don't forget to subscribe if you enjoyed the video and obviously give us a little thumbs up and until next time mwah, au revoir bye bye everyone <laughs>